Hi everyone, it's Mary Jane Cops, the phone lady, and um, I'm pretty excited about today's video. I'm not doing it off the cuff, which I often do. I actually have notes here in front of me. Um, the topic is humility, and I only added humility to the list of characteristics or skills involved in story finding recently and I can't remember what inspired me to add it but I'm so glad that I did because the research that I've done is has indicated to me that humility is the very foundation of story finding it actually should have been the very first video but it's going to be the last one I think so What's with humility? Well, we struggle with it, I think, because we think of it as a place where someone um, thinks less of themselves. And when we look at the etymology of the word, it, it does have those meanings of uh, being small or lowly or insignificant. But as language evolved, humility took on in the Latin the meaning humus, which means earth. And it became connected to individuals who are well grounded, who are confident. So in reality, humility and confidence are partners. They go together. They are always together. When you meet someone who is truly humble, they are confident in their abilities, in their knowledge, in their skills. They're also very confident in their knowledge that they don't know everything, which is pretty cool, right? And when you're thinking about story finding, when you come to story finding, you have to know that you don't know everything, especially about your prospects your clients and your customers. So when we are embracing our humility, we lose the need to talk about ourselves, to um, voice our opinions, to tout our accomplishments. We just don't need to do that. We're able to give our energy and our focus to the other person. That's what story finding is all about. And in this space where we're acting from both humility and confidence, it's where all the other skills or aspects of story finding are able to blossom, are able to strengthen and grow. I'm gonna give you two examples. So when we are humble and confident, our empathy is easily available to us. We are open to thinking about that other person and what might be going on in their world and how that's impacting this particular conversation or this particular interaction. And our intuition comes into play we're really able to count on our intuition to give us additional knowledge and wisdom about this prospect, customer, client. And that brings to mind uh, the C.S. Lewis quote, which is, um, humility is not thinking less of yourself, but thinking of yourself less. Perfect in terms of empathy and intuition, for sure. And the other two aspects of story finding, which are buoyed by humility, are our listening skills and our curiosity. And both of these things are so essential. We have to be curious about our prospects, clients, customers. That's where our great questions come from. And when they speak, we have to be able to listen really, really well. 
And this brings to mind another quote by Charlie Van Heck. He is a, a sales specialist and his quote is, ask with confidence, listen with humility. I love that. And it's so true. So again, when we are embracing our humility, yes, we know that we have skills and we have value, but we also know we don't know everything. And that allows us to hear things and, and learn things that we otherwise wouldn't be able to. So I'm really, really glad that for whatever reason, I have added humility to this story finding list. Um, it's really been enlightening for me to do the research and prepare this work and also very empowering. And I hope that you find it that way yourself. Um, always interested in hearing from you. Um, you can pop over to thephonelady.com or email me at maryjane at thephonelady.com with your thoughts on any of the aspects of story finding. And what the next video will be, I'm not sure. Um, as in many things in my life, I don't necessarily pre-plan to the nth degree. So there will be more videos on this channel, but at the moment, I'm not sure what they are. So thanks for taking the time always to watch these videos and share them. I appreciate it so much. And I wish you all the best in your story finding. And um, you'll hear from me again soon.